Hey, how's it going, guys? This is Knasty3890 here with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. Uh, before I get started, I do want to just say a uh, happy Thanksgiving for everyone out there. Um, I'm recording this. will be coming out on Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. I will be not able to upload any videos Thursday or Friday or maybe Saturday. I am going out of town. I'm visiting family. So I will not be able to come up with any videos, guys, Thursday or Friday. Hopefully Saturday, depending on what time I get home. But I just wanted to say a little happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Hope you guys are in, will enjoy it with your family and friends. Um, be thankful for what you have. Don't ever take that for granted what you guys do have, no matter what your situation is. Um, but, with that out of the way, I do want to just say that, guys. Um, there's some new stuff that came out in Mutt today. First off, there's some objectives. And also, there's a set in the game which I don't want you guys to do. But first off, there's new objectives which pay out crazy, guys. First off, you know, I can't see all of them because I've completed most of them, but there was ones for improving your overall that started off like in the 70s and then go up to a 92. Once you get all these, you get a legendary pack. Um, there was finishing solos. Like I think if you finish 100 solos, I think it was, you then get coins and packs and badges. Um, and there's another one that if you did sets, like a, um, you finished a legend set, you finished a team of the week set, a hero set, you did all those, you then got packs and coins. So far, I've gotten 69,000. 500 coins. I was trying to do the math. I might be off a little bit. And if I get my team to a 92, or when I do, I will then get another All Pro pack, 9,000 coins, and a legendary pack for finishing this whole thing. So great job by EA. Now you don't need to be, you don't need to be on Mutt Rewards. You don't need to be anything like that. You just have to have done this stuff during the game, which is great. So if you have a farm account, like I have a farm account, I don't have all those objectives on, but I have some of them. I'm getting some free coins, some free packs. As you can see here, here are my unopened packs. Now, I'm not going to open up the Pro Packs and the All Pro Packs right now. It's a Wednesday. Wednesday is the only day of the week that they do not have a limited time card out. I figured I'd wait maybe on Saturday open those up uh, when the new Legends come out. But we'll open up all these other packs. we got badges. And I don't know what are in these Rookie Packs. If there are Gold Cards in this, I will wait. But they're probably just Bronze and Silver Cards. Can we sell these? You can sell them and you can... Because, like, that card... Silver card, and I'll take it. Bronze car, uh, bronze cowboy, I'll take it. So that's nice that you get some uh, free bronze and silvers, which are, trust me, if you get like a bronze, um, let's see, there are some good ones. Nothing in that, but if you get like a bronze red skin, that's a really good one, guys. Also, if you are wondering, I will be coming out with my um, December which cards are expensive video, hopefully the day of or the day after the new December Heroes drop, which will be soon. It'll be in like a week or so. This one's a good one we got a bronze uh red skin that's one of the better bronze cards to get all right so those are the way we'll put up all these badges uh so we got what three badges eight badges 15 25 total badges i will gladly take that maybe cop uh two golds two golds maybe an elite hiding in here i don't know i doubt it but this, and like i said guys there's a new uh set where you can spend some of your badges and i'll sh tell you guys why i really don't think it's worth doing it um and I'll explain that in a second. So 10 badge pack. We got a good amount of silvers. I mean, we got what? Four silvers and by all the bronze. That is a, literally a bron uh, gold a gold badge. If I add all that together, that is a gold badge. Not a bad badge pack. Obviously, you want elites. <laughs> but I don't know. I feel like ever since it came out with that gold player pack, which required gold badges, I feel like badge packs have been definitely nerfed. Um... I feel like no matter what I do, I get the minimum. Even if I add like the five gold players, I will get two silver uh, badges out of that. As on this one, we got five bronzes. All right, so we didn't get anything crazy out of those badge packs. We'll save all these packs for probably Saturday or Sunday. And I will show you guys the new set. And I'll tell you guys why I don't think you should do it. All right, so they actually changed this up. Redemption's now second from the front. It's a second from the back. Uh, so that's interesting. Thursday night drafts have been moved to the back. Um... And where are we? What are we looking for? Burn badges. Here we go. We're going to go down to premium playbooks. Trade-in badges are in a pack that gives one random offensive or defensive premium playbook. So you get one playbook, offense or defense. Takes four gold, uh, four bronze, four silver, three golds, and elite. So an elite is what? 20K? Maybe 25? 20? Let's just say 20K. We'll go low. Gold badges, let's just say, are low. At, we'll go low at five. So right there, that's 20, and then that's 35, and let's say the silver and bronze would take you to 40. Let's just say 40,000 coins to do this. So you can sell all these badges for 40,000 coins, or you can take a chance at a uh, premium playbook. So you got to know this, guys. Just the value of those badges is 40. This is why I don't think this is worth it. 
we're going to go look at some of these playbooks. I was going to open up a bunch of these, actually. I was going to like, let's open up five and see if it's actually worth it. And then I was looking to see which ones are out there. Mm, no. <laughs> no, no, no. All right, so we're going to Elite. And we're going to Playbooks. So, um, as you can see, like, some of these offensive ones, like Run Balance, balance uh, or just Balance or Run Heavy, these playbooks are going for, like, 10 to 20K. Dirt cheap. Um... Let's check some uh, defensive one. Let's do multiple defense. That is always one that's good. So multiple defense is going for 50. That's like one of the better ones. That's 10,000 coins more than if you just sell the badges. And that's not even including tax. It could even be, it'd be even more like 5,000. It's completely not worth it. Let's look at some other ones. The 4-6 defense is always pretty solid. That one's worth it. That's... Take that 88 one. That's going to sell quick. That's 100K. So the four, if you get the 46 defense, worth it. That's actually worth it. Um, Let's take a look at some other offensive ones. Let's just type in offense. See what else. Ooh. Maybe you have to do like this. And uh, of course not. Um, Let's do pass. Oh, air attack. I remember was one. And I'm trying to remember from, was it last year, two years ago, what ones were expensive and they used to have these. Uh, let's type in just, I guess, pass. Here we go. So, pass balance. That one's not really worth anything. I guess we have to type in alternate offense. Now, if you guys know of any other playbooks I am missing, which ones are the expensive, let me know in the comments. Uh, all right, run and gun. That one in West Coast might be expensive. So, West Coast, there's one for 57. Run and shoot's 40. So, I mean, you know, run and shoot's actually less than that. Run and shoot's 30. 28, I mean, 26, it's not, that's not worth it, you're losing coins, pistol, you're going to lose coins, um, let's see, west coast, you're going to lose coins, 35,000, probably the only one you're going to make coins out on will be run and gun, that one is probably worth it, let's see, run gun is worth it, that's 100k, so there's a couple of them worth 100k, your odds of getting them, not worth it. I would not recommend it, guys. Don't do this stuff. If you really want those playbooks, you can probably snipe them. You could probably just sit here and just like keep refreshing this, and you might just see someone post it for 50K and be like, I was going to do this set for 40, buy it for 50. You'll probably get a good deal on that. Now, um, so I would not recommend that, guys, but all this free stuff they gave you is great, and if you have a farm account, grind those solos, make your team a little higher overall. You're going to get packs. You're going to get coins. You're going to get badges. It's really good. I'm glad they did this. Um, and real quick, let's just see if there's any other alternate defenses that might be good. The 4-6 is the one that people want. Uh, alternate D, the 4-3 might be expensive. 50K, 40K, not worth it. There's some, I mean, if it's at 40K, I really don't think it's worth it. Oh, nope, 28K. There you go. Not worth it, guys. There's like, there's literally two playbooks that are worth it. Now, they are double the price, more than that. However, still not worth it. But, hope okay, you guys enjoyed this video and have a great Thanksgiving, guys. Like I said, if you do want to talk to me about Madden or anything, I will still be on Twitter. Like I said, I mean, I will have service where I'm at. I will not have access to a PlayStation, so I can't do any recording. Um, but, like I said, I'll see if you guys want to talk, talk to me on Twitter. But I'll see you guys on Saturday. Take these guys. Have a great Thanksgiving. Enjoy the food. Enjoy the football. See ya.